Hey guys, what's up? In today's video, I'll be showing you all a nice way on how to make your uh, applications into icons without running it from the command line. So let's just get into it. Okay, so firstly, we need to install. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I think it's pronounced a la carte or a la carta. We're going to sudo apt at install a la carte. So we want to run this. Okay. So I already have it, but this is what you would do in order to install the program. Okay, so now we have the program installed. What we want to do is we want to go to applications and write main menu. You won't have this if you don't install the program. Okay. So now what we have to do is we have to press new item or if, if you want it in the usual applications like how i have pycharm over here you press on that usual applications button or if you want to do information gathering you press on that you know whichever one you want so i'll just go to usual applications new item let's say pycharm command okay so we're gonna we're gonna browse for pycharm and it's right here for me. But how did I get here? Let me just show you guys real quick. I normally put my downloads in the opt folder. So press opt. Uh, the PyCharm folder is right here. Let's click on that. Okay, so it's in the, if I'm not saying the bin folder, yeah. So you can choose the PyCharm PNG or the SVG file. So I'll just use the, PNG for the icon. Yeah, I must stop right there. Over here, you want to click on this button over here and PNG. Okay, so now you have the icon. And to, to find the command, you go to the same place wherever you have downloaded it. So I have I have it at opt file. That's where. Just good practice to put your downloads and stuff over there. PyCharm, uh, bin, okay, and this the PyCharm dot dot sh. You you want you want the program name with the dot sh, and that's pretty much it. You press OK, and then you press OK, and since I have PyCharm already, I'm not gonna do it twice. So let's close this and open PyCharm real quick. So since I put it in um, usual applications, you right click it and over here it'll say add PyCharm or add to favorites and you just click on that. And when you go to your favorites, it should be there. And it'll take a moment to open. And this is with any, uh, any application with whether it's tor whether it's one well, yeah so there you go and it'll open and it'll work like how it how it normally should and that's it if you guys liked it please hit that like and subscribe button until next time have a great day